What's up you guys, what's good? I will jump right into this video and uh, we just gonna do the damn thing. So first and foremost, I have been gone for quite a long time. If you've been following from the very beginning, you guys quickly learned that I loved YouTube and everything that comes along with it. I love the relationships that I got to build with my subscribers, fellow YouTubers, and just doing this craft. It's so much fun and it's really, really rewarding. The one thing that I learned that was a negative, not everybody who says that they're going to help you is here to help you. I do a dream board or a vision board each and every year to start off my new year and kind of round up my year in the way that I want it to be. So my vision board for 2016 had a lot to do with YouTube and my goals, um, my family goals and everything that I basically wanted and I had visioned and wanted to come to light. So on my vision board, I had included that I wanted to sign a contract with a very big YouTube contracting company. This company to me was like the holy grail. Yeah, that's the best way to describe it. The holy grail of YouTube. Is contractors even the right word? I don't even know. Let me know down below. But I wanted to sign to them for the longest time. I put in a lot of work in the beginning. There was a lot of things you had to have done to qualify for them to even sign you. And when I finally hit all those qualifications, I was signed in hype. Guys, if you're starting a YouTube channel, you're new to YouTube, that's something that you're looking into doing, look into it a little bit deeper than I did. I didn't look into it at all. I went over the basics. I was like, the people that I follow and love are related to this company specifically, so this is my number one goal and priority. This company may not have just been for me, um, and again, I'm speaking on personal experience, but they didn't do anything for me. They didn't help me. And they took a large chunk of what I was making off of YouTube, which isn't really a lot if you're a YouTuber, you know, and pocketed it for themselves. And when you're not helping me, you're not allowing me to grow. You're not giving me information to help my channel. What gives you the right to take my money, like my hard earned money? Like you guys think working a minimum wage job <laughs> is hard like YouTube is hard YouTube is its own hustle and own grind so shout out to all the youtubers who are doing their thing consistently I fuck with you guys this shit is no joke that's what I was talking about so they were taking 30% of what I was making every single month and pocketing that for themselves 30 percent that is not okay I was not okay with it I thought I signed a one-year contract with them. My one year came up. I was like, hey guys, I'm out of here. They were like, no, you're not. And I was like, cool. I actually read my contract and took the time to read it. And I was like, damn, okay. So I figured everything out. I gave them the heads up that I wouldn't be staying with them for the second year and completing my second year contract. What that meant for me. So for me, I was like, I'll, I'll keep doing my videos. I'll say, focus on what I'm doing and just keep grinding. And it got tiring, like I'm not gonna lie, it just got tiring. I was constantly reaching out to them saying like, hey, what can I do to improve this? What can I do to improve this? What do I need to do to fully be successful and have the audience that I want to have and I feel that I can truly have? And I wasn't getting the help that I needed. So about a year and a half in, I was just like, fuck it, my language, I'm not making videos anymore. You guys are not taking the little chunk of money that I was still making at that point and pocketing it for yourself. Like it's just not happening. So I stopped making my videos. I basically said, bottom, and I was out of here. Like, I was not doing it. I was being stubborn, I'm not gonna lie. I low-key was miserable <laughs> for six months because I really love doing this and I'm really excited to be banging this shit out again, like really excited. So that's where I've been. My contract is up. It was a struggle to get out of this contract. So <laughs> that's its own story and I, don't think that I can even speak on who this company is. So if you're wondering, if you're following me in the beginning, you will know, because I'm pretty sure I made a video about it. If you weren't, then I guess you'll never know. Moving on. So I told you guys I have some exciting news and I, I'm really excited to share it. Like, I'm really excited to share it. If you want to know it though, I'm actually sharing it over on my family channel, not Lady Gentle. I don't think that it's for this page yet. And I want to revamp my page as to what I'm doing on my channel. So I'm gonna be sharing it over there on Friday. So Friday, you can check out that news over there. If you guys think, 
or want it to be over here, I can do that. Let me know. I will start uploading it to my channel on a certain day though so that I'm not throwing anything else off for the people who come here for a certain reason. So moving forward, my channel so far, I know I'm gonna have Mondays and Wednesdays down pat. I don't know what I'm gonna be doing for Fridays, but I know I'm not gonna be doing makeup tutorials anymore. So if that's what you were here for, I apologize. I promise my face will still be beat. I might drop a one-two video on Insta, so you can follow me there. But I'm not gonna be doing the um, YouTube tutorials on makeup. I love them, I love makeup. It's just not my wave. So let me just stick to what I'm good at, you know? Okay, so Mondays are going to be motivational Mondays. I'm gonna to come to you guys and talk to you guys about some real shit I don't feel like people want to talk about or care to talk about and I would be the person to talk about those things. If you know me, you know. So motivational Mondays, I'm gonna be covering topics and doing different series with you guys every single Monday. Tune in for those if that's something you like. Wednesdays are still going to be weight loss Wednesdays, but if you were following me for weight loss Wednesdays, Earlier in the year, you know I was changing it to Wellness Wednesdays and that's what they're going to be called now. So Wednesdays are going to be Wellness Wednesdays and again, Friday I'm trying to figure out what I want to squeeze in there because I do want to be dropping three videos a week to kind of stay in touch with you guys. So if you guys have any ideas of what you want me to be bringing to my channel or what you want me to talk about, if you want to see makeup videos once in a while, I can maybe throw it in on a Friday, but I'm really not trying to guys, okay? So just please don't suggest it. But let me know what you want to see. I am really excited just to be back and interacting with everybody. And I don't know, it's just really exciting. Like my creative juices are flowing again and your girl is ready. So thank you for sticking around for so long. I appreciate you guys. And I think that's it for today. I will see you guys on Friday. Probably Monday. I'll see you guys on Monday. But if you go over to my family channel, A Queen for a King, you can check out my news there. There's going to be lots of stuff over there, but it's all more so family content and my day-to-day -day life, so vlogging stuff. If you're into that stuff and you wanna see what I'm doing on day-to-day, -day, go subscribe over there to A Queen for a King. You will meet my husband and my two babies. And uh, that's all for today. I will see you guys later. Toodles.